Hello and welcome to Vapes and Bakes. Thank you so much everyone for being uh, so patient with our channel. Um, and I did promise you an update last week, uh, but things have sort of been quite slow, so I haven't managed to quite get that done yet. So here I am doing it now. Um, so little update of the of the channel. Um, as you can see, I am currently on my own, um, and that's because me and Cam have decided to go our separate ways. We've decided that we're going to do um, that. I'm going to do the channel on my own, I'll go solo. Uh, so this decision has been quite a hard decision for both of us to come to, um, but we kind of decided this after um, after having a chat about where we are, where, uh, what we're doing work-wise, um, and Cam has um, started a whole new uh, thing, doing a whole load of skate tuition and working with a skateboarding company. Um, he's also got more responsibilities at work. Um, I've picked up a whole load of new stuff at work and I'm doing uh, consider considerably more hours. And also with being um, two counties apart, so Cam is actually based in Somerset and lives there, um, and I live in Devon, uh, in Exeter, so having to commute to actually see each other to get stuff filmed was uh, quite difficult. Um, and we found that we would have to uh, film a whole batch in one day, I'd have to bake loads in one day, um, and it was just quite difficult to get all that done really, and find finding the time and squeezing that in, and then... Uh, the money for travel and, and whatnot. Um, so yeah, so we've decided to go our separate ways. Um, and it's all amicable. Love the guy, he's great. Um, and actually, if there are any of you out there who have a kid or if you want to learn how to skate, I think uh, Cam um, offers skateboarding tuition for anyone who's seven years uh, old and older. Um, so I'll post a link for his email down below so you can get in touch if any of you viewers are from the Somerset area. Now, I really hope that with us, with me going solo, that you guys are still going to show the same love, care and support that you've shown the both of us, because you guys, our viewers, have been incredible. And I couldn't thank you enough. Um, you're all amazing and I love you all. Um, particular thanks to um, people who have given us advice, loads of tips. So particularly Pud Puffs, uh, Flat Cap, Nice Guys and uh, Jules, who have all given us loads of advice, loads of um, opportunities to go on live uh, and stuff like that. So that's really awesome. So again, thank you so much for that. Now, just to tag on the back of this, I'm gonna do a very quick hardware review because I was sent a little while ago an absolutely amazing little pod by G-Taste. It's uh, called the Mimo Air, that's the box. Um, and inside the box you get your standard USB charger um, which looks like that you get a uh, little fill bottle which is great so this little bad boy here um, you get the pod itself you get a spare where you get the device itself you get a spare pod in there as well both at 1.8 ohms um, and you get all the all the standard stuff. You get a um, manual on how to use it, on how to charge it, and whatnot. Um, you get a little scratch and sniff for authentic, uh, authenticity. Um, yeah, and I I love this thing. It's amazing. Um, so just a little close up. That's the branding on the side. Is it gonna uh, focus in? There we go. And then on the other side, it has the Mimo Air. Uh, on it, is that good? There we go. Um, so this device, in terms of uh, pod flavors, a while ago uh, I reviewed another pod that looked kind of similar in shape. Um, it was the E8, um, and that thing was fantastic, and that kind of set the benchmark for me on what uh, you should be getting from uh, pod devices and whatnot. Um, because the flavour was incredible, the battery life was incredible, everything about it was absolutely incredible. And then I received this. Um, now, the flavour production from it is just insane. So I'm actually, uh, I've got the unlimited Pomberry Plunge in there. So is that going to focus in? Probably not, because it's technology and it's me. Where are we? No. 
Okay, it doesn't want to focus in. But that's the uh, Pomberry Plunge by Unlimited. Um, and I've also got the uh, Get Some Grape over here as well. Um, but yes, the Pomberry. Um, it's incredible. If you need any uh, pod salts or anything like that, um, any nick salts for your pods, get over to them. They are fantastic. Um, now, let's, let's give this a vape and come right back to you. So, as you can hear, well, probably can't hear, it's actually a really, really quiet device. Some devices have that little whistle to it or something, um, which I'm not too keen on. Um, this is really quiet, it's really subtle. Um, yeah, the other thing that I love about it is, you probably can't really see it on the camera, but the actual pod, this top bit, is very translucent. And that means that you can see really clearly where the juice levels are in it, so you never have to be run, run dry. A lot of other devices, um, you either have to pull up the pod out to check, or, um, or you have to hold it up to a light to be able to actually see through it because it's so dark. Um, but no, this one's really simple. It's just a, um, it's just a drag and go type thing. There's no button on it. It's just it's an auto firing. Um, as you can see when it's vaped on, there's a, a light that comes on the bottom to show that it's firing. Um, the airflow comes in through the bottom, which is where the charge port is. Um, and in terms of the technical stuff, so it's got so 1.8 coils, 1.3 mil uh, fill capacity. Um, it's got a 450 milliamp hour battery. Um, and, you know, that may not be, that's not a massive battery, but... I have found that I I take this to work with me now all the time. It's really handy. Um, so I take this to work with me. Every break that I've got that I can go outside, I'm on this uh, like a shoot. Um, and, you know, this lasts for a good day and a half, um, vaping during my break times. Um, and that's that's incredible. Um, that You don't have to charge it midway through the day. Um, when it's charging, the there's a light that comes on, um, it glows uh, that blue as you're as you're firing away on it, um, and that will flash twenty times to tell you that it's fully charged and it will disappear altogether. So, it's got um, it doesn't keep overcharging. Um, it does cut out when it's full. Uh, when it's running low, it uh, flashes ten times to let you know it's gone low. Now you can keep vaping past that until it's dead, but generally we recommend not to do that on batteries because you. Overall, you actually reduce the overall life of it. Um, so, all in all, I love this thing. The flavour is fantastic. Um, it's not a huge cloud, but it's a small little pod device, so you're not going to get that. Um, and yeah, I really couldn't recommend this one enough. And thank you so much, GTAs, for sending this one over. Um, it's a great piece of kit, and I love it. Um, so, keep doing what you're doing with this. Um, and rating out of 10, I'm gonna give it a solid nine. It's great, it's fantastic, and I could not find a single fault on this. Um, just quickly, if you're wondering why there's a little bottle that comes with it, um, that little fill nodule is actually really quite thin if you compare it to the fill, the filling bits of standard bottles. So when you're actually filling up the pod, this little bottle could be really handy to fill up jam in the fill hole so the fill hole's just there. Um, it's a little silicone stopper, really easy. Um, and these pod, pods last for, I've had this going for a good couple of weeks now and there's not even a slight hint of um, weird flavour or any burning or anything like that so it's really great. great. So yeah, thanks so much guys for watching the update and watching this little pod review. Um, as I said, 9 out of 10, solid. Puck it.